morning everyone today is october 8th monday and my health update um this is going to be two videos in one i had decided that i was going to do my monthly measurements separately but i kind of forgot so I'm doing it now along with the other health update. So we're going to do that first. Um, so last month in September, my neck was 15 and a half inches. Um, this month, it's still 15 and a half inches. No change there. My left arm in September was and this month it's 16 inches. I gained an inch and I think I know why. Um, where I volunteer I have had to drag heavy bags down and I've been using my left arm a lot more so I'm going to assume that that might be a little bit of muscle gain. I probably lost fat but at the same time I lost or gained some muscle. Um, I don't know. I, uh, I think a whole inch of muscle is a little much, <laughs> but I mean, it's been a month, so maybe not so far fetched. Um, my right arm was 15 and a half inches last month. This month, it's 15 inches. So I actually lost a half an inch in my right arm. Um, I've been using my left arm a lot more with uh, the up and down the stairs with heavy bags. So, I mean, that would, that would again, explain why I gained an inch in one arm and lost half an inch in another. At least that explains it to me. Okay, so under my chest, under my breasts, last month was 42 inches. This month it's 40 inches. So I have lost a couple of inches there. And then around my breasts, um, last month was 45 inches. This month it's 47 inches. So I gained two inches there. Not what I was looking forward to, but and I'm not sure how to account for the gain in boob there. <laughs> um, my waist last month was 49 and a half inches. This month it's 46 and a half inches. So I lost three inches off my waist in the course of the week, in the course of the month. Um, my stomach last month was 50 and a half inches. This month, 49 inches. So a half, an inch and a half lost there. Um, my butt, 50 inches last month, 50 inches this month, I didn't gain an inch. My thigh, my left thigh was 25 inches in September. This month, 23 and a half inches. <clears throat> so, one and a half inches lost there. Um, right thigh last month was 24 and a half. And this month it's 25 inches. So, I gained a half an inch there. Um, my left calf last month was 18 inches, this month 70 and a half, so I lost an inch. And then last but not least, my right calf last month was 17 and a half inches, this month stayed the same. Oh no it didn't, sorry, I'm not reading my own notes right. 17 and a half inches last month, 17 inches this month. I am 
my stuff there because I have the uh, math at the end so that I did not read that correctly. That says a negative half at the end of the October. Um, so my bad. So there have been some good changes, especially in my waist. I was not expecting a three inch loss in my waist. That's awesome. That is awesome. So there's that. Um, again, there was some gain, but I'm kind of wondering if because I've been doing a lot of pulling of heavy things and Um, I just totally lost track of what I was talking about. Sorry, because I'm trying to do 50 things at once this morning. Um, because I am getting ready for an interview. Um, I have an interview this afternoon, so. Um, so yeah, I'm not sure how to account for the, the gains. I'm assuming it's like a muscle gain coupled with loss of the fat, I'm not sure, um, yeah, I'm not sure, at all, <laughs> I have no clue, but I did gain some, but I also lost quite a bit too, so, um, I'm still sticking to my Saturday weigh-ins because Saturday mornings are like the best time for me to go out and just weigh myself because I don't have a scale here at home. Um, so last week I was at 219. This week I'm at, I actually turned the screen brightness down this time. As I remembered beforehand, there it is. Focus. There we go. Two seventeen. That's another two pound loss. Um, and I'm going to quickly do the math. Um, so. I was 260 when I started my journey uh, November of 2017, so it's almost been a year. So from November 2017 to October 20, October 2018, I've gone down 43 pounds so far. Okay. I'm really happy. Some people might say, well, that's not a lot for how long you've been on this journey. Well, no, it's not a ton of weight, but it's, it's weight that's gone. And I'm happy it's gone. Um, especially considering like the last two weeks up until literally yesterday, I've not been eating keto. Um, because of finances. We had no food in the house really that was keto. So I had no choice but to eat carbs or starve. And I was not gonna starve myself. So I ate the carbs and I still lost some weight. Uh, I'm assuming that's probably because my body has become fat adapted and I've not been like gorging myself on the carbs. I've been eating, I've been eating the carbs, but I've been eating them in moderation. So that probably has a lot to do with it. But yeah, I have, I've still been losing weight and I'm happy with that. So I started keto back up yesterday. Because we finally got some funds and we were able to get some food that was keto. So, I'm back to eating 
you know. Um, I'm happy about that. Because I was starting to kind of get worried because I was like, I made all this progress and I don't want to lose it. I want to lose the weight. I don't want to lose the progress. Anyway, so one more thing before I go. Because we got on bin finally, I went to Walmart and I decided that, you know, my, my 20 or not 20, 42, I wish I was 20, <laughs> I wish I was a 20 something waist, but I'm not, I am still in the 40, uh, my 42 30s that I got a few months back are falling off, like my 44, um, 30s were, um, before I, um, uh, switched, so I'm going to go see, I'm going to go grab the next size down, and see how they fit. I walked out of Walmart with a new pair of pants, guys. I am a down, I am down a pant size. I am now, I've gone from 42 30s to 40 30s. I've actually gone down two pant sizes since I've started this journey. So I started at 44 30. And now I'm down to 40-30. I'm down two pant sizes. That's awesome. So yeah, I walked out of Walmart with a new pair of jeans. <laughs> Only one because I wanted to make sure we had money for food. So probably next month I will grab another pair just so I have more than, you know, one pair of size jeans that I need um so I'm really happy about that too okay guys so that is my health update um actually no it's not so my transition is going to be stalled um because my doctor is not back from maternity leave yet. Um, I need, in order to get testosterone, um, I need not only a referral from a, a therapist, um, which I will have. He's already said, you're ready for testosterone. You're beyond ready for testosterone. I'm going to continue working with you um, through your through your uh, problems and your transition, I'm going to give you your referral, but because they need two referrals from not just me, but your uh, PCP, I'm not gonna send mine in till around the same time she sends her in, hers in, so that you have both at the same time and they can't deny, they shouldn't deny you. Um, so, the testosterone is on hold. I'm not sure how long. Um, I cannot remember when my um, PCP went on maternity leave. So, I'm, we're just kind of sitting on hold um, just so that we make sure that I can get my testosterone and they don't just deny me. Um, so, there's that. Um, I'm a little bummed about it. I'm, I'm a little bummed because I was really excited. I was like, yay, I'm going to get to do this. And now I have to wait some more. <laughs> I'm just so ready to transition, guys. I'm so ready. I'm beyond ready at this point. Like my, my therapist said, you're beyond ready. I am definitely beyond ready. Um, I, kind of, I feel like I've waited long enough, but it is what it is. Um, I'm still making progress in that journey, so I'm happy with that, but a little bummed that things are kind of stalled. Um, got my TENS unit, and that thing is amazing. I love it. Um, 
might do a video kind of showing it to you guys. Just being like, hey, this is what it is, and this is what it does. Um, I might, I don't know. So yeah, I might, we'll see. Um, anywho, that is visually my health update for this Monday. I will see you all Thursday for the Oracle card reading, and then again Saturday for live tea time. Um, because Saturday was such a crazy day um, between finally getting our funds and other things, I totally forgot Saturday. <laughs> I apologize. And I think that I also did my Thursday Oracle card reading on Friday instead of Thursday. Probably, I think I did. So I apologize for that too. Um, I'm not doing very good with sticking to my schedule. Things have just been crazy. But hey, I did do two videos last week. I'm going to do, I'm going to do my best to do three this time. Um, all right, guys. Thanks so much for joining me. I hope you'll have a great day. And whatever it is you're doing, just keep going. <laughs>